Hi, my name is Expressor from Team Liquid, and this is my bot lane guide to Kalista Bard. Kalista Bard is a very punishing lane in solo queue. For example, if you're trying to play Thresh or any of the melee supports, you're going to get punished heavily because Kalista has a lot of has is able to poke you and combine with Bard's decently strong auto attacks. And if he lands a Q on you, you're going to take a lot of chunk damage. And especially because Kalista just does a lot of damage if um if you let her auto you. So definitely a strong lane in solo queue, and it's super reliant on getting the good autos in there and just not getting CC or getting hooked or getting engaged on as you're trying to poke them. So Bar Kalissa is a fairly strange combo. The way they work is that Kalissa is fairly good at poking and Bar is pretty good at poking as well. Decent range and Bar can provide some sustain. And then once they hit six, Bard is pretty strong in initiating fight. Kalissa is also good at saving Bar because Bard is very He's very easy to kill. He's very bubbly and he's like, people love killing Bard, so having Kalista there really helps out Bard to not die as much. So level 1 and 2, Bard Kalista is fine. Um, ideally, you want to take the jungle camp and just uh, hit level 2 quicker, but if you don't, it's fine as well. Uh, level 1 and 2, you just want to use your autos a lot and try to land your Qs on Bard if possible, but ideally just poke them. If you can both, both you and Kalista can land an auto attack, then you're in a really good spot as it does a ton of damage. And at level 2, you can look for all-ins, it's doable, but be careful as Bard's level 2 power spike is more sustained than it is an all-in. At level 3 and 4, Bard Kalista is still a strong combo, so you do have your sustain from Bard, and Kalista is getting pretty strong at this point. But be careful as, because Bard is level 4, at level 4 you usually get your journey, it doesn't do that much, it doesn't do any damage. It's mainly used to set up for ganks and in some ways run away from ganks, but it's not the greatest if you're just stuck in lane. So you want to be roaming, but be careful for Kalissa as she can get ganked. And if you're pushed up, your combo can get ganked pretty easily as well. So while you're trying to poke, at the same time, be wary of where the jungle could be and always look for an escape path if things get sticky. At level 5 and 6, Kalista Bard is going to get their ultimates, obviously, and their ultimates actually don't do any damage. Um, Kalista's ultimate is just a CC, and Bard's ultimate is kind of opposite of that, kind of freezes them in place and can't really hit them. But the thing is, is that you can CC them for a very long time. It's fairly guaranteed as well if you land your Kalista all first. Um, so you can set up for ganks very easily, and once you... Once you get out of your, your stasis from your bar all, you can actually land your stun 100% guaranteed by timing it correctly as you would to time a Zonia's. Um, same idea, just wait two seconds and then try, so I cast a Q then and hopefully you can get double stun. And with how strong Kalissa is in team fights or in these situations where she's kind of all inning and she gets a lot of um, run sacks or you can land your Q or whatever you're maxing, then you just can do a lot of damage and you can go for kills there. Bard is meant to roam. His whole kit revolves around roaming with his passive, his chimes, getting more chimes, increases his strength. Um, his journey allows him to get behind uh, targets, go through wards, stuff like that. And yeah, he's meant to roam. But when you have a Bard Kalista, you have to be really careful about roaming because Kalista doesn't have too many good escapes. So you need to be careful of where Kalista can go. And hopefully you don't you know, abandon your AD carry as she's dying and whatnot. So be very careful about roaming, but do look to roam. Kalista level 6, bar level 6, you can definitely look for plays mid. Using Kalista ult, you can initiate um, and just throw your bard in there. Or you can use bard on to initiate as well. You have a lot of options, and this is a very strong roaming. It has a lot of potential uh, to kill mid laners that don't have any escapes. Bar Kalista has the best matchups against melee supports and are obviously an AD carry as well. Um, but melee supports basically can't really poke um, early on and they usually don't have too much sustain and they can just get poked really easily by bar autos and cluster autos. So melee supports are generally not good against bar. So anything from Alistar to Leona or even um, like a Nalus, all these champions don't do too so well. Thanks for watching my bot lane guide to Kalista Bard, and make sure to check out the rest of my videos over at lawclass.com.